Be advised, this man is neither trained nor professional. Talk to your doctor before engaging in any of the activities you see in this video. Your allergic reactions, chemical burns, and general discomfort are not the fault of Tubb, and he accepts no responsibility. All right, we all know the rules. As many bites as it takes. Reviews from the Tub. Reviews from the Tub. Gonna review sh from my Tub. What's up, y'all? Look at this. This is called the Pizza Pie. Today is February 9th, Thursday, National Pizza Day, which means wherever you are, I hope you're celebrating with a nice pizza pie. And if you're watching this in the future, not on February 9th, you don't need a certain day on the calendar to eat pizza since it's the most magical food ever. So what we got here today, if you are familiar or not familiar with this gentleman, Dave Portnoy, he's made an empire out of going to all these pizzerias all over the world and eating a slice of hot, fresh baked pizza. Comes out of the store, one bite, you know the rules. He says it a million times, you can't forget the rules. He tries one bite of, pe one bite of the pizza pie, lets you know what he thinks. Well, my man there is now in the frozen pizza game and we're gonna try his frozen pizza. I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm not the biggest fan of that gentleman. He's not my cup of tea, but whatever. He's, you know, good on him, he's doing a thing. But I do feel that if you're gonna be that pretentious and review pizza pies and then throw your name and your brand on a pizza pie, this better be the best frozen pizza pie I've ever had. So, as many bites as it takes, you know the rules here. We got the five cheese, what do we got here? Mozzarella, cheddar, provolone, fontina, and parmesan cheeses. It's a frozen pizza. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. This needs fixings, boy. Whether it be salt, pepper, garlic powder, sprinkle cheese. You know. You want to try this? Yeah. We're going to give a bite to the camera woman. It's hot. It is hot. I mean, it's good, but... Um, it kind of it tastes like kind of like a Celeste. It tastes like a Celeste pizza. Yeah, maybe the one... I think it's a little thicker, which is not... It's actually less appealing. I like the thinness of the Celeste. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he had like a like a meat bomb pizza, a meat lover's gimmick, a vegetable gimmick. I just went with the plain. I, I would have to go with plain. Right, I want to go with the plain to get the most, you know, and, and uh, I got to tell you. Anybody can make something good with bells and whistles. Yeah. To be that far up your own ass and then produce this and put your name on this? Come on, man. This is, this is, uh... I think if I was f***ing hammered and eating this at 3 o'clock in the morning, this would be amazing. Well, and frozen pizza defense, that is pretty much what it's for. We're yeah. Not, well, you're hungover, though, so also another good Yeah, time. yeah, yeah, yeah. You would think the hangover would help this. This ain't it. You know what else is very pretentious and annoying? My content on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and Twitch. Guys, go over there. Give me a follow. I'd greatly appreciate it. We're always posting stuff. <laughs> we got t-shirts for sale on Bonfire. We're going to start a, a podcast. We got one episode out. We're going to get that rolling. It would be greatly appreciated, man. Give me a follow. Check it all out. I love you guys. Uh, there's a little logo that just appeared up under my face. You can click that. It'll bring you right to the subscribe thing for the YouTube. Got a couple sample videos off to the side there. And man, I really appreciate y'all. Without you, I'm just eating this crap-ass, frozen-ass pizza by myself. Bye.